Hi, I'm Rob Johnstone, Editor-in-Chief of the Woodworkers Journal Magazine. I'm back in the shop exploring how CNC routing can enhance our woodworking experience. You know, I can drill holes pretty accurately, and I can drill a bunch of them. But what if I had to drill over 200 holes and drill them all perfectly? Like, say, if I was going to make a cribbage board. Well, that's a task that the CNC router can do perfectly every time. And so I'm going to use the CNC today to help me make some gifts, some cribbage boards that I'll be able to use later. So let's get started and I'll show you how we do it. One thing a CNC router can do really well is drill holes and drill an accurate pattern, but it doesn't need to be registered off the side of a square board or anything like that. We can put that pattern perfectly into an odd shaped piece of wood. So I'm going to do that with this cut off limb section. I think it'll make a cool cribbage board and I hope you'll agree. We've taken care of the computer programming for you. There are .crv files and .tap files available as a free download on the website. Those of you who are more sophisticated in your CNC skills will be able to modify and tweak them as you choose. Those more like me or still learning the ropes can simply load the files and start up your machine. My standard disclaimer remains true. I always run your program from start to finish on scrap lumber first to check for any bugs. If something goes awry, you can always hit the emergency stop button on your screen interface and start over. In this instance, while there is no through cutting that would require a backer board on the CNC deck, I used a large 3 quarter inch thick piece of plywood clamped to the deck to check the program. This gave me the added benefit of being able to place the organically shaped piece of stock on the deck in relationship to the completed test cut, so I could easily locate where the cribbage board pattern would be drilled into the wood. Drilling 240 plus holes takes a while even for the CNC to complete. The handy thing is that once you get the cribbage board done, you can get busy doing other tasks while the machine is boring holes in the next cribbage board. Fortunately, the CNC does not require close supervision. Notice that the CNC is programmed to drill each hole in three steps. This is called peck drilling and it allows for waste to be removed from the peg hole as it is being drilled. This keeps the 1 8 inch diameter router bit from losing its edge. Cribbage is a very old car game that is gaining popularity, surprisingly even on college campuses. Cribbage boards make great gifts for people of all ages and they have the attractive feature of not requiring a lot of material. For me, making quality gifts from scrap lumber is about as good as it gets. Two hundred and twenty some holes, all per all perfectly drilled. So that's it. Accurate drilling every time using a CNC router. If you'd like the files for this drilling pattern, they're available online. We also give you a link to a template that you can use to. Uh, drill this the old school way with a, with a dr hand drill or a drill press. I hope you enjoyed this uh, example of how to use a CNC router for accurate drilling. Thanks for watching and keep on making sawdust.